Here we go with another Justice League versus Street Fighter Mugen playthrough. As I said in the last video, Guile would be next. Let's go! We're doing this for America, and we just hate Steel. Steel has been our first opponent for the past couple videos now. We just hate him. We just want to save Doomsday back there. Guile. Oh, they used the hilarious Japanese voice. Sardic Brrrr. There is his launcher, that's all I needed to know for Guile. And he's got the flash kick and he's got another move here. Wait, that was it? Oh my god, they made that into a s oh. You know, they gave every character three specials and two supers, which is good. Because technically in the world of Street Fighter, Guile only has two supers, or two specials. Oh, at least he's got his German suplex, which I'm fine. What did he say? You are disgrace. Uh, Japanese American Guile, best Guile. Ooh, Sonic Hurricane! Take that! Hiya! I know. You know. I think I've mentioned this before too. Guile's walk animation. I think they might have changed it up in the newer games, but in the old games, it's just weird. It's weird. Super Somersault. Ah, oh, three hits. That's good. German suplex. Killed him. Kevin Rookie. Oh, God. Hey, Predator. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I just realized something. Guile was played by Jean-Claude Van Damme in the Street Fighter movie. Jean-Claude Van Damme was going to be the original Predator in the original Predator movie, but he said it wasn't for him. Or something like that, the suit or something. I don't know. This is a battle between the Jean-Claude Van Dammes of the movie universe. Or not, I don't know. I, maybe I'm just overthinking things. But this is insane. This is the greatest thing I have seen. We got basically Bloodsport 50 or whatever. I don't know. How many blood sports were there? I don't know. But yes! Easy operation. Sorry if I'm mocking the Guile voice. It's, it's just hilarious. You can't see Guile's legs here either in this concrete jungle. Did I say concrete? Am I saying that right? Concurred? Well, you can't see his legs because Guile's pants is made out of the same material that is, well, John Cena. Because we can't see John Cena at all. Do, 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 do. See, wrestling seems to come up in all these videos for some reason. And no, it's not because I'm hinting at a next playthrough to be a wrestling playthrough. It's probably not going to be. So don't get your hopes up. Easy operation. I wonder if there's a, like a Mugen wrestling game. I gotta look that up. Like a fan-made wrestling Mugen game. I know there's some wrestling characters from Mugen that are trash, but fun to you, such as, uh, Stone Cold's always fun to just one-shot stunner people. I know there's a uh, there's a Rock for Mugen, which also sucks. There's a Batista for Mugen, which is eh. He's an eh. There's a Triple H for Mugen, I believe. And uh, I know there's a Rey Mysterio. And there's a CM Punk, which is actually pretty damn good, surprisingly. But yeah. I want to see if there's more. Not counting, like, um, video game characters or movie characters. Like, actual wrestlers. Because I know of Muscle Power and, you know, Zangief, yeah. Wow, we just jumped right through each other there. Suck on this! Oh, wow. I don't know. That was going to be a cool combo, but nope. You just had to go and ruin it, Wonder Woman. Stupid, stupid Wonder Woman. We just beat the game with you, too. Come on over here. Come on. God damn it. Just jump back. Who knew? My one weakness. Jump backing. Or back jumping. I don't know. Oh, wow. Off the wall. Wait. Guile can off the wall hit? Oh, yeah. His heavy air attack. Air kick. Off the walls. Interesting. So Guile seems to be like a really good character in this. Balrog! 
Balrog's ready to box just like Guile. I got my boxing stance, and Balrog's like, come on. Sorry. I said Balrog's theme is probably one of the most underrated themes in Street Fighter. I mean, it's... What is that, a Mega Man Cross Street Fighter where he's just following you around? Like punching you or trying to punch you and he one-shot punch you, kills you or something? That was one of my favorite parts of Mega Man Cross Street Fighter. Even though Mega Man Cross Street Fighter is nothing more than a fan game and then Capcom's like, yeah, we're going to license it. We're going to release it for free, but hey, you know, hey. You know, it happens. Alright, Balrog. That means, uh, Darkseid or Bison's next. Wow, that's Sonic Hurricane, son. Oh. Totally forget that Guile does a double sweep. So it's like, you have to hit both. To, uh, knock him down. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Sonic Hurricane! Damn it! You know, I kind of wish Guile had his, um... Air backbreaker. Oh god! Look at that. See, if this game had intros, I'm sure these two would have a special intro. Guile charging at Bison and going, Bison! And Bison would probably stand there laughing. You know, because Guile's looking for Nash, but little did he know he's just behind the fence of his stage. Here. In this game, that is. Da -da -da -da. Oh, oh, okay. Well, Bison, that was easy. Come on, Ricky! This is for Nash! That's the dog tags. Those guys' tags are those Nash's tags he wears. Not so sure about that. I know he gave them in uh, Street Fighter V, he gave them back to Nash. Nash's dog tags, I believe. Spoilers, by the way. Right? That's what he did, right? He's like, this is long overdue, or something like that. It's funny, I played through the story mode of that game and I can't remember a damn thing about it. Except for the fact you play Chun Li very late in the story. <laughs> Come on, Ricky. Dang it, Parallax, you went to a different color. Usually a darker green than this. That's fine, you and your tiny head. You're no match for my flat top. The Sonic Boo! Oh, it got him in the legs. Which means he can no longer fly. Oh no, he can still fly, he just can't walk. Because he doesn't know how to walk, he can only fly. Aw, oh, come on, he was dashing. You know, I'm getting a little tired of this stage, too. It's just, I don't know where... Yeah, this stage just doesn't, eh. It just, eh. Maybe it's because I've seen it so much during these playthroughs. Just realized something. It looks like Guile stands on his tippy toes there for his stance when you stand still. See, how the hell does one walk like that? Like I said, Guile's walk is weird. It's like he he moves his legs at the same time, although it looks like that. And they're in the same motion, so I don't know. It's just a weird walk animation to me. Yeah, that was like that in Street Fighter 2. I'm not sure if it's... I can't remember if they kind of switched it up in the newer games. Maybe he still walks like that, maybe he doesn't. Well, who cares? Guile's awesome. He's awesome. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this Justice League vs. Street Fighter Mugen playthrough. Stay tuned for some more. The Dark Knight! Da -na 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 -na. Batman is next! My name is Clickerothide. Thank you all so much for watching.